On top of breaking news, after more than three decades, three local families find closure in their loved ones' cold case homicides. Alan Wilmer Sr. died several years ago, but tonight he's accused of killing two people in Isla White County and another person in Hampton. The duo found shot to death in Isla White was part of the commonly phrased Colonial Parkway murders. Angelique Carantock has the story. The suspect accused of carrying out the killings is Alan Wilmer Sr. of the Northern Neck. Because he was never in the system, he was never in the CODIS database, there was no hits. We had a common suspect, he just had not been identified. It was this summer when investigators say DNA evidence linked Wilmer to the victims. According to Virginia State Police, Wilmer is responsible for the death of 29-year-old Teresa Terry Howell after she disappeared in Hampton in 1989. Wilmer is also accused of shooting and killing 20-year-old David Nobling and 14-year-old Robin Edwards in Isle of Wight County in 1987. The duo became known as victims in a series of double homicides coined as the Colonial Parkway murders. Police agency spokespeople read statements from the victims' families. Now we have a sense of relief and justice knowing that he can no longer victimize another. While we are grateful for the closure that has been provided, nothing will bring Terry back. The void left by her absence over the years is inexpressible. Officials say Wilmer died at 63 years old in 2017 at his Lancaster County home. At this time, he isn't linked to any other unsolved crimes. Let us know if you knew him, how you knew him, what encounters you had, so we can build that timeline and find out if, in fact, there are other victims out there. Angela Garantalk, 13 News Now. Investigators say Alan Wilmer Sr. had a 1966 blue Dodge Fargo pickup and a fishing boat named Denny Wade. If you know anything about him, dial 1-800-CALL-FBI or go online at tips.fbi.gov.